Hey guys, what's up? This is Tom from Gaming Entertainers. Ah, oh, sorry. <laughs> I just hit the camera twice. Sorry if that gave you a headache. But now I'll be reviewing the Pearl Podium for iPhone 3G. Um, when I unboxed this, I said it was for the iPhone and iPhone 3G. It's just for the 3G. Um, yeah. So first, what I like about this Pearl Podium is it's made out of all metal. It's very, well, it's not very heavy, but it is weighted. That is all metal. All metal there. And if you do notice, it looks like the Mac uh, stand. Mac OS X. Yeah. I mean, not Mac OS X, what I'm saying. It just looks like the Mac Macintosh. Um, it's white. This is the Pearl Podium. On the bottom is rubber so that when you have it down on the table, it does not move. Um, let's take the iPhone out really quick. It's easy, just pop it right out like that. It's not in too hard. And right here it says podium. Let's see. Podium for iPhone 3G. So, yeah, it is the podium for iPhone 3G. Um, these are, like, bendable rubbered clips. So, how the phone goes in is you just simply take your phone, put it in that side, and, let's see, pop it in. Very easy. And then, there. Very nice. Um, I do have one problem I found with it. When I'm trying to hit the button right here, it moves up. I'm trying to hit the unlock button. I mean, the, the phone actually moves down. See, watch. And you actually have to hold the phone pushing that button, or it will fall off. So that is one little problem I have with it. Um, the other problem isn't really a problem for most people, but I'm a freak like that. I have to have it perfectly aligned. See, right now it's not aligned perfect. I have to have it just perfect. Like that. I have to have it. If it's not perfect, I have to. I sit there forever fixing it. That's not a problem for most people, but it's a big problem for me. Like it's bugging me a lot right now. But oh, overall, it's a very good product. Um, let's say, let's give an example. So, you're a business person, I guess. Let's give. I'm just gonna make an example. And this is at your desk. Your laptop's right here. You need to check an email, so you open it up. And you simply touch the mail button, and then you open up your inbox, and you can just go swipe and check emails, pick a random one. Okay, so and then yeah. Oh, and see, that's a problem too. The buttons, when the phone slides down like that, it hits the buttons. So that's, that's a problem, I think, in my opinion. But it's not too bad. Okay, so yep, you can have like have this on your desk and look through email while you're typing on your laptop right here, so that's pretty cool. Um, yeah. Uh, you can also, let's say, you go into your iPod. I don't have any movies right now, so this is not really a good example. But say you have a movie and it's a wide and you want to watch it in widescreen, you just go like that, and this is just an example, but uh, your movie is in widescreen and you can just, you know, have it sitting on your desk or whatever and watch the movie. So, I think that's pretty cool. Um, yeah. Overall, this is a pretty good device. I, it's, I'll have the pricings in the description. I forgot about it right now. I should have wrote, written it down, but I just forgot. And now I'm being a freak again and trying to align it, and it's not aligned. Uh, so yeah, hold on. Well, like I said, one of the only... See, look, it just went down again because I moved the phone. That's what I'm not liking. Because this slides down too easily. Most people won't be moving their phone around like that. But, yeah. So basically, the only cons I have is... When you hit this button, it slides down. If you, and then that will go... And that's basically my only... The only cons I have about this device... Other than that, um, I highly recommend this device 
to most people who want their iPhone to sit on their desk when they're checking email and instead of holding it, you know, things like that. So yeah. Um, I give this device, well, it's not really a device, I'd say, but it's like an accessory. I'd give this accessory a 9.4 because of the cons. The cons aren't too bad, though. So that's it. It's a 9.4 out of 10. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe, rate, and comment this video.